What's going on guys? Back at it again with a brand new series here on the channel. This one, as you can see right in front of you, is on The Rise of the Tomb Raider, the second in the uh, installment in the Tomb Raider franchise that, frankly speaking, the first one I really, really thoroughly enjoyed. It wasn't probably as good as like the Uncharted series, but there was a lot of similarities between the two, and that's something I could always get behind because those style of games is something that I find very enjoyable. And Tomb Raider definitely lived up to that hype for me. Very excited to get into this, guys. I am a big fan of Lara Croft and everything that has to do with the Tomb Raider series. I'm not like a lore buff behind the series or anything like that, but I do enjoy it nonetheless. Very excited, once again, to get into this, guys. If you are too, do me a huge favor, drop a like on this video. Also, subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed, because it really does help this channel grow. So with that being said, Enough yapping, let's jump right into this. What makes someone reach beyond the boundaries of human experience to face the unknown? As children, we question the world around us. We learn, we accept. And gradually, we lose our capacity for wonder. But some do not. The explorers, the seekers of truth. It is these pioneers who define the future of mankind. There she is. The others, they're done. No amount of money is going to get him through those mountains. The lost city's up there, somewhere. Okay. That's going to be a hell of a climb. I'm not turning back. I know. You should stay here with them. Not a chance. They're good friends, it looks like. The graphics definitely look better than the previous installment, that's for sure. Oh, absolutely. You're almost there. Wait till you see this view, Lara. Take my hand. Man, that looks cold. Thanks. Look at that. It's amazing. But the snow coming off those peaks is a bad sign. Oh, I'm moving. I'm playing. Have a good view of the valley beyond from the summit. All right. Let's take it easy here. Wow. This wind is crazy. We just need to keep moving. Oh my god, dude. That's a hey, big note for me. Even if we don't find anything up here, your dad would be proud. I know, but I have a good feeling about this. Is there is there subtitle? I think I need to put on some subtitles. Well, there's no think. I know that I need to throw on some subtitles. I don't see it though. Oh, there, there it is. Uh, with I mean, I guess with color. That way you know who exactly who it is. Wait for me. Oh my god. Oh my god. You okay? Nope. Lost my footing. I'm fine. Oh snap! Wait, what did I just do? Oh my god. That was close. Did I? Are you alright? Absolutely not. I'm here! I'll climb down there and get you! No! It's too dangerous! Okay. I can so climb back up! I already did. Do we, so we automatically start off with the axe in this one? Wait, hold on. There we go. It's a little, it's a little wonky. But I think it's just a matter of me getting used to it. 
Oh! Quick time events. I need to jump across. Yeah. Okay. I grab my hand. Uh. Gotcha. That's a long way down. Shit, Laura. You're gonna give me a heart attack. Are you okay? No. Yeah. Thank you, my blue jacket wearing friend. I got some XP for that. Looks like we gotta go through. Dude, I went through the last game with d barely doing any crafting. It was pretty amazing. <laughs> <laughs> Not bad. If the weather turns, we can pull up in this game. Ooh. Do you really think we'll find this lost city? Absolutely not. I know this is a long shot, but that old tracker said he saw ruins up in these mountains. If I didn't mention this before, I am playing this on the PS5. I don't think I mentioned it before, but yeah. Oh, that's windy, and that is gorgeous. My God. For being last gen, looks good. We have a couple hours at most. Should be enough time. We're almost to the top. Why are we trying to get to the top? This looks dangerous. What do you think? We're close to something, Jonah. I can feel it. Just this last stretch to the top. All right. Let's see what's up there. But keep close to the wall. Okay. Seriously, dude, I could never do this. From here. Keep your eyes open for falling ice. Right. You I'm scared of heights. I would I would die. I would fall two minutes into the climb. Just saying. There's lots of loose ice up here. Let's take it slow and steady. Just stay with me. We're gonna die. The game's gonna be over in five minutes. Oh shit! That was close. We made it so far. I'm terrified. Are we going up? Yes, we are. Okay, I'm getting the hang of this already. Starting to smooth it out, uh, smooth out a little bit. to jump uh she's got some serious upper body strength I'll say that much oh there it is Jonah we made it I see the ruins oh god I'm actually doing this. Come on, Laura. Almost. Let's go. Ah. Got it. No, no. Laura, I can't hold you. The rope is ah. me. Oh, I was too early. We're gonna die. One more. Let's go, Laura. Woo! 
I got XP. Oh hell no. Nah. Go back, Jonah! Get to shelter! Oh my god, Becky. Oh! I wonder if the deaths are as brutal as a previous game. Ah! Airplane! Oh my god. That's a nope again for me. I need a parachute. Oh. Ooh, I love this opening. Run. Holy shit, do that. Jump. Holy. Did we die? I think that was supposed to happen. I I hope. That was intense though. Not gonna lie. Two weeks earlier. London, England. Dad's research. Cruelty of life that we're all too swiftly taken from it. We age, we decay, we die. But what do we leave behind? Bones? Dust? What of the soul? Does it endure beyond our earthly existence? I believe it does. A truth lies at the heart of many myths and stories. A truth not of science, but something more profound. The key to unlocking everlasting life. I may have found the next piece to the puzzle, but I'm not alone in this search. They're following me, watching my every step. I know them by name now. Trinity. An ancient, violent sect with designs on controlling the future of humanity. I must proceed carefully for the sake of my family. If anything were to ever happen to Lara or Anna, I could never forgive myself. Who that? Oh, it's just Lara. Wait, so then who was looking? I, I thought it was Lara looking around. Lightning and then Batman's gonna be sitting on one of the roofs. Damn it, I was wrong. Really thought Batman was gonna be there. Oh. Uh oh. Oh, it's me, Hannah. Oh God, I'm so sorry. That scared me. What are you doing here? I saw the gutter press was attacking you again. I thought you could use some company. No lies. Were you followed? Followed. Of course not. What's going on? I think I found that too. Oh, you can't be serious. The myth of the prophet is real. Dad was right. Lara, your father was unwell. No, 
He was close to a great discovery, tangible evidence of the immortal soul. I loved Richard. I would have married him if he'd asked. But he was a broken man. I don't want to see you end up like him. But Anna, he was right. It was everyone else who was wrong. The tomb's in Syria. Syria? Oh God, Laura, no. This is madness. Get your life sorted. Go home to the manor. You know I can't go back there. But this obsession ruined your father. That sucks. I saw something. Something I... I can't explain. Now I understand what Dad was going through. It's all fairy tales. Nonsense. Don't go down this road. You know where it leads. It's the only thing that makes sense to me now. I'm going to find the Prophet's tomb. <laughs> Well, we just learned something about our father. He was a kook. He was cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs. Hey, we're heading into a war zone now. We better be sure about this. We're close. There should be an oasis in the canyon just ahead. You're wasting your time. There's nothing out here. Just keep driving, please. It's Her hair looks amazing. For being last gen, this game looks fantastic. I think I said it already, but still. Something isn't right. Oh, that's just local militia. That's chasing us. You told someone, didn't you? They, they paid better than you. You both. Shit, they weren't supposed to shoot at us. Get us out of Of course not, you idiot. Oh, he's dead. He's dead, dead. Hey, we arrived. I don't hear Siri, though. You have arrived at your destination. Oh. Her truck is on fire. Ooh. That looked painful. Northwest border of Syria. Uh, uh, Syria. For some reason, I almost had Cyrodiil. Wrong game. Search for the ruins in the cliffs. We're dying here. We are dying here. There was something in Dad's research about this. It was said the Prophet's tomb was hidden in the cliffs above one of the forgotten cities. Legend speaks of an oasis where the Prophet was laid to rest. Interesting. Oh! These ancient rocks are breaking on me. Can I jump up? Yes. Yes, I can. Nathan Drake, Something's aka here. Nathaniel Draconis, has his climbing abilities uh, being challenged. Could this really be it? Ooh, I love blue. Favorite color, right there. Ooh, daddy was right. Some kind of marker. I think that's a pillar there, not a marker. Just kidding.
Good job, Dad. Is that Jesus? Explore the chamber of the murals? OMG. Okay, he's shown here performing healing miracles. Dad's notes mention this. That actually looks real, like it would be an ancient mural. Oh, what's this? Seems to be a map of some sort, but I can't quite read the words. I can't quite read the words. That was a horrible interpretation. He led Jesus! His followers through the desert to the oasis. This is definitely going to be me going through a wall. A secret entrance. A secret entrance. Doesn't look very secretive to me. Oh god, too bright. Too beautiful. It's amazing. If only Dad could have seen this. Daddy O is dead there. Uh jump to wall and X to scramble. Oh, I pushed. That looked that, that looked weird. Let me fall. Okay, maybe it was just me. It didn't look that bad the second time. For some reason, it just looked a little awkward the first time. Can I jump that high? It does look a little weird, but nothing too bad. They're already here. Got to get inside. I'm pretty sure this would have been discovered a long time ago via helicopters. Oh my god. I almost pooped myself. That was scary. Good job, Lara. Come on, baby. The Order of Trinity pursued the Prophet and his people relentlessly until finally confronting them in their hidden oasis. Okay. <laughs> I really thought I was going to be able to jump over there. Oh god, that was funny. Okay, let's try that one again. Oh, they're... Oh, stupid. The Order of Trinity pursued the Prophet and his people relentlessly until oh. finally confronting them in their hidden oasis. What is this? Bunch of ancient conquistador stuff? I hate spiders too, man. Heights and spiders are two of my fears. Oh! That scared the shit out of me. Scorpions! Kick! Following in Father's Footsteps is the name of this achievement. Very nice. There was a battle here. Armed soldiers against religious pilgrims. The Order of Trinity. Is this suggesting Trinity like the Holy Trinity? My son, the Order of Trinity has received word that the Prophet's followers are building a great tomb at an oasis outside Berea. But more upsetting, while we thought they were building the tomb for their prophet, Trinity now believes he still lives. We have learned he is preaching his heresy among the local citizens, drawing more to him daily with his tales of how he conquered death. He is a liar and a heretic 
claiming miracles that come only from the divine. You swore he was dead. Have you failed us? Yikes. That's scary if he was if he actually is alive. Oh! Why am I so jumpy today? My god. Do I have to shoot this too? Oh, okay, no. <gasps> it's a long corridor. Who there? They're blasting their way in. Oh, that's that's always fun. Just destroy history, why won't you? What's this? Nothing? How do I get out of here? Might be a way to release that old platform. Let me in! This works. That's it. I need more water. Huh. Let's take a look at this. Yeah, I thought this was what I was gonna. Can I jump? Huh. I mean, I clearly. Oh. So. I need something to stand on. Bingo. So I can blast this thing right here. Kablam. And now I got a boat. Be careful. We all know what happens when you stand on something like that. You die according to Titanic. I'll never let go, Jack. That's a pretty elaborate plan. Faster, Lara. Oh my god. She swallowed a lot of water. Wow, that's gorgeous. Stunning. We made it, Dad. Okay. Okay. Too easy. I want to go to the river now. I don't know why. Bingo. Okay, I mean the game is just starting admittingly, but these puzzles are not very difficult But I'm willing to bet they're going to get a little bit more Difficult as it goes forward. This is probably just like tutorial status, you know Oh It's gotta be this way Haha, -ha. I'm a genius Yep, yeah. Nathaniel Draconis, a.k.a. Nathan Drake, a.k.a. Uncharted Man, has his climbing abilities. Wait, hold on. Where am I going? How do I get... Oh, I know how to get that. Oh god. There we go. Oh! Get it! Nice! Let's make our way back now. Maybe this way? Oh! What am I supposed to do? Damn. They're almost inside. 
That would have been death for sure. Well, maybe. Impalement doesn't kill anybody nowadays, right? It's another one. I saw that one. Holy sh... Oh, I have to do both! Oh my god, that was so freaking close. That was insane. I almost died. Wait, what's this? Ah, oh, yes, another one. My lord, what you say is impossible. I myself drove a spear into the prophet's heart. I saw him die. Doubtless, his people have propped another man up in the slain prophet's robe to continue his lies. Makes sense. They are broken, discredited, and exiled. We will head south and put the rest of his people to the sword. But the prophet is dead. This, I swear. I hope you are right, my friend. My dead, knightly friend. Was I supposed to use that? Or maybe I'm supposed to use this. Okay. So maybe I have to do both. Huh. How do I get back up there? Found it. So I have to do something fast. Climb. No. Okay. Oh, right there. No, wait, that's where I came from. Okay, this is gonna use about 95% of my noggin because I'm kind of stupid, but it's okay. How? Huh. What if... Oh, wait a minute. That's gotta do something. Let's go. Run. Haha, -ha, I made it. That was 95% of my noggin right there. Hold on. Yikes. We almost drowned. This is really cool though, I'm really enjoying this. I like these kinds of games. A lot actually. Found you. That's that Lord man? Or is that the prophet? There's no body. Don't tell me she's gonna hide in there. Is that the main antagonist? Set the charges. They're gonna blow this damn place up. <clears throat> the 
prophet's tomb. After all this time. And the artifact? Inside. God willing. Open it. Carefully. It could be extremely dangerous. Uh-oh. You already know. Trinity. Where is the artifact? I don't know what you're talking about. Don't play games with me. You led us to this place. Look, it was empty when I got here. There was no body and definitely no artifact. He's going to try to kill us. Oh, she's Get good. Down! Did I get shot? No. Can I not pick up their gun? Well, that's blasphemous. Hey, hey he'll be all right. Jump! Woo, I love this. I love this. Run! Ooh, yes, I'm having so much fun. I love Lara, man. She's so cool. Oh shit! Run, Lara! I'm surprised none of those rocks. Holy crap! Knocked you out yet? We made it. This reminds me of the um, Elsewhere expansion trailer. It's a clue. Huh. Oh, back at Croft Manor. Surrey, Surrey, I, uh, England? I probably mispronounced that, it's okay though. Oh, it's homeboy. Jonah! Laura! There's so much I need to tell you, I don't... Did you find the Prophet's tomb? Yes, but I was followed. What? Also, no Prophet. They call themselves Trinity. They tried to kill me. What the hell is going on here? You're starting to scare me. The tomb was empty, but I think they were looking for the Divine Source. The, the artifact your father was after? There's more. I found this symbol in the tomb. I knew I'd seen it before. It was driving me insane. That's when it hit me. I saw it here, in one of Dad's books. Listen to this. The lost city of Katesh, said to have disappeared in Siberia sometime in the 12th century. Legend says that on the eve of the invasion by the Mongol horde, it sunk beneath a lake. What does this have to do with the Prophet's artifact? The same symbol. <laughs> if the divine source is hidden in the ruins of Katesh, waiting to be found, then I have to go. To Siberia? Are you kidding me? Just think. If this thing could really unlock the secret of immortality, it would... It would change everything. Sickness, suffering, death, gone. Are you listening to yourself? Jonah. We've been through so much together. You know there's more out there. This could be real. I don't care if it's real. I've lost too many friends. I don't want to lose you too. Dad never made the connection to Katesh. He gave up everything for this. Including you. Including Stop his own life. Stop blaming yourself for what happened. 
He made his own bed. I can't give up on him. Not now. It's all I have. No, it isn't. If you stayed still for five minutes, maybe you'd see that. Damn. He's passionate. So is she. She is angry. My God, he just choke slammed her. Jonah's gonna save her. Holy shit! Save me, Jonah! Stop. Drop the book. You can't stop us. I would have just shot him. Shit, Laura. What are we gonna do? We? Now it's we? I let them do it, Jonah. If the divine source is real, we've got to find it first. Siberia it is then. Jonah's with us again. Very nice. So now it's where we started the game. Yes, I think so. <laughs> so we survived the avalanche. No. Oh, she looks freezing. Go back. Please don't try to find me. Oh my god. Ooh, she is cold. A cold welcome. The a quiet a quite a tumble is the name of this achievement. So we're gonna find a campfire probably like we did in the first game. Maybe? Question mark? Keep moving. Come on. You can do this. Man, this looks so cold. What is that? Yeah, I was right. Oh, there it is. Okay. Okay. Got to start a fire. I have, do I have to get supplies? Gather resources? Yeah, I thought so. Okay. Luckily, they're all right here. Give me my sticks. When do I get my bow? That's my work. Not enough to last the night. Uh, need to gather more. Oh, she Sorry is enough, so man. cold. I hope. Food? Fresh kill. No meat, but maybe something else I can use. The hide. Wolves. Well, we're going to be fighting wolves, apparently, very soon. Move, damn it. Oh, it is super windy. 
I've never experienced winds this hard before. I imagine lighting a fire might be pretty difficult too, though. <coughs> because of the high winds. No, oh, that was... She built a shelter very quick. Look at her. Men are scouring the ruins of the mountains. If the artifact is here, we'll find it. And what of the remnant? They continue to resist us. But we'll have the situation in hand soon enough. Good. Trinity has faith in you. Trinity. They're here. Magically, she's no longer cold. Oh, I'm gonna make a bow! Yes. New weapon available. Makeshift longbow. So okay. This pain wasn't so familiar. Like looking an old enemy in the eye. It wants to take me down. It wants me to just lie down and die. But I won't. I can't. There's something here. There must be, or Trinity wouldn't be in this snowy hell. I just hope that Jonah is okay. That he Me too. Way back. I, I just couldn't risk having him with me. Not again. The pain of losing him, that would be too much to bear. This is my path, and mine alone. You know, this, this story reminds me a lot. So, as I'm recording this, I had just finished uh, Horizon uh, Forbidden West, right? The story was basically... Uh, I'm not going to spoil it, any actual details, but the story was basically her wanting to do everything on her own until she realized the value of friendship and help and all that stuff. Kind of sounds a lot like that, you know? Except that game was not as good as I hoped, if I'm being completely honest. It wasn't a bad game, but I wanted it to be better. Okay, so what are we doing here? So we got... So we only have one... So, reinforced limbs. Stronger limbs allow for increased... Uh-oh. Allow for increased uh, stirring tension and faster arrow speeds for more damage. Applied to all bows. So, if I... Does that mean... If I get better bows in the future, this upgrade will apply to that too? It says apply to all bows. So, I'm assuming yes. Let's just go with it. It's kind of funny that right off the bat I got more damage. So let me see what else I got over here. I could have upgraded this to weapon switching. Switch uh, between multiple weapons of the same type by using weapons menu. Each weapon has unique stats and upgrades that provide a distinct combat feel. Can I see your change? Yes, this looks very tribal. I like the first one, though, if I'm being completely honest so far. Wow, this takes a long time to switch between outfits. I wonder why it takes so long. Okay, so that's nice shade. Doesn't look much different from the previous one. Oh, she's a knight. Immoral. Immortal guardian. That looks dope. Very Dark Souls-esque, though. Okay, that looks more archery. What is it called? Hope's Bastion. Expedition Jacket. So this looks... a lot like the first one. Let me see real quick. Oh, no, wait. That's... So that's the one... That's the one I already had, right? That's gotta be the same one that I had already. But let's see, leather jacket. I'm sure that's the... Okay, that looks cool. That looks very Lara Croftian. That one looks very tactical. 
Man, this takes forever. I like her character model. She looks she looks good. How many of these do I have, dude? I got a ton. 16 apparently. How do I have 16? That looks exactly the same as the one that I had on, but white, which is okay. But I do like the look of the of the red one. Spirit Weaver. I might actually just stay with the red one. It's my favorite one so far. Like, the, some of these are not bad. But the one, the red one is my favorite one. So far, they see, like, this one's cool. So this is the last one. Reimagine Antarctica outfit. In Tomb Raider 3. Like, the original Tomb Raider 3 or the one that's after this one? Alright, I'm staying with the original. So that's it then, right? What do I have in inventory? Okay. Skills. I got skills available. Brawler. Hand-to-hand -hand combat. Uh, combat. Hunting and scavenging abilities. Survivor crafting and exploration. So that's all I got. So let's look at what we have here. Thick skin. Take less damage from enemy gunfire and melee attacks. That actually should come in clutch a lot. Effect is cumulative with the Heart of Stone skill. Ironhide takes significantly less damage from explosions and fire. Incapacitate unarmed enemies while dodging with a well-timed uh, press of the button of the triangle button. So Brawler seems like very survivability type stuff, right? Uh, Efficient killer. Enemies killed while its stealth will automatically... Uh, will be automatically looted for resources. That sounds pretty good. Let's see Hunter. Gain a chance at recovering arrows when looting enemies killed with a bow. Increased steady aim. Time on bow charged slots. I like this. Increase the amount of ammunition looted from enemy corpses. Animal instincts. Uh, animals gr uh, glow when using survival instincts. Larger animals have footprints and blood trails that are easy to follow. I, I like... So far, I like a combination of both of these. Let's see what Survivor says. Uh, rapid crafting. Faster crafting of throwable objects and ammo when on the run. So, so you can craft while in combat is what I'm gathering out of this enemies killed or knocked out from crafted handheld objects yield more XP incendiary bombs craft explosion explosive bombs from red glass cans and deadly proximity mines from enemy radios okay um lightfoot Land safely without damage from su uh, substantial heights. Press circle to roll when landing. So we get to parkour. Avid learner. Learn bonus XP from survival caches. Documents, relics, and challenges. I'm sure they're all over the place. So that might come in handy for the longevity of the game. I'm not sure if we're going to take it though. Um, eye for detail. Find challenge objects more easily using survival instincts. I think I'm going to go for a hunter. I do like the idea of getting more ammunition, ammunition though. Let's just go with that. Okay. I think the next time around I'm going to go with something a little bit more... Uh, I I want to say survival, survivability, but this is a survivor one. You know, in my opinion, all of this is for survivability. Gets you more able to, to survive basically okay so we're we should be good uh blood ties unlocked the dlc blood ties the okay tougher than she looks is the name of this uh this uh achievement but anyways blood ties unlocked the dlc blood ties has been unlocked and has become available from the main menu nice so echoes of the past explore the forest 
for signs of the lost city. Does it auto save if you use this? Or do you have to save yourself? Fast travel? I'm not sure. Okay, yeah. So it auto saves when you leave the campfire. So do we have a map? So it's not that far, it looks like. Current objective. Explore the forest for signs of the lost city. So we're still on this. All right, let's let's go. This uh, this little area doesn't look that big. So let's go ahead and go check this out. Mm -hmm. 